the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Sheriff Annie Klein, who is in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Well, this is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Anthony. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. Oh. All right. <laughs> well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I got to say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood winter getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's going to be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but I just want you all to know, um, it means so much to me that we're doing this and that you have a lisp <laughs> i know it would mean so much to hannah and beth that we're we're all still here together and i'm thinking of them i really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and you know okay so Let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? How do you yes. party like a porn star? You just have one big orgy? Like, I don't understand how... How they would... Like... What? Damn, this intro scene is just taking... Ten minutes. <laughs> Damn, this music is tough. goes up a mountain first off and stops at what's the minimum wall ten hours until dawn. Oh no. Alrighty, so this motherfucker's already back? Damn dude. This guy this guy wasted no time. Best friend. Diligent, considerate, adventurous. Okay. Hello? <laughs> run, there? Sam, run! Oh. Creeping. Past the cave of crustacean. I'm not, I'm not wearing very much for being up on the mountain. Considering. <laughs> Taking a look forward, thank you. Can I get the lint? Oh, okay. Alright, so this game based around little shiny lights, okay. Uh, what? The gates boss did climb <laughs> over. <laughs> Alrighty, so let's let's climb over then. Safe. We'll be safe above there. Uh, oh, quick time event. Shit. Uh, Go 
just climb it. I think the sound's coming out of my controller, actually, for the first time event. It's like, it's pretty good. Alright. I'm liking this game so far. It's very... It reminds me of like a movie, but it's obviously not a movie, but it's controlled by me, and it's, it's nice. I like it. Alright, so... An hour's until dawn. Oh. Mr. Wireless controller is full. Huh? Yeah, I'm not moving. Last one, okay, I'm not sure what to do next. Oh. Right, relationship status. Josh and Matt, damn dude, I'm a freaking, damn this chick is all about that, that guy, she just does not give a shit about the chick. Alright, um. Okay. Don't exactly, okay, so I just need to get to the cable car station. I presume. Oh, now she's getting cold. That's what you get for wearing, like, tights and fucking a skirt. <laughs> cool. Okay, that really didn't do much for me. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. How do I, okay, can I do stuff with it? Maybe? When I say, I'm starting to get scared about these things. Oh, okay. So there's different totems. That's probably what the sign was saying to me. Whether or not the prophecy comes true depends on the choices you make. Oh, okay. My totem collection. Alright, that's that's pretty cool. Alright. So someone's backpack. Chris? You here? Damn it, Chris. Not in the bag, are you? I mean Hello. Pieces of him might be. <laughs> I don't know how brutal this game is, so snoop. Let's be a snooper. Butterfly effect appears when your actions are changed. Oh, Chris. Ew, what the fuck? Detective and humorist and methodical has a crush on Ashley. Scared me. Uh, I'm sorry, are, are you my secretary? I was buzzing. Cool, well, thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. <laughs> That's one long ass freaking phone call. <laughs> oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you until you get it. So, come on, this way. Where? Right around here. It's going to blow your mind. Blow your mind. <laughs> All right. I don't know what, what, what the know. hell is a shooting range doing at the oh. base of Key Lodge? Uh, dude, oh. have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He was just like Grizzly Adams or something. Grizzly? <laughs> oh, no, you go ahead. <laughs> Alright. Table car station. Here goes. Do I get to shoot shit? Oh my god, I do. Professional shooter over here. Wow, nice with the tail. All right, <laughs> I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. 
Nah, I don't think so, girl. Told I've played too many video games in my life. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Except for you, bitch. There you go, shoot a, shoot a squirrel. Oh, don't make me shoot a squirrel. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh! Holy sh- Bullseye! What are you doing? How could you do that? Chris, that is so effed up! What? That poor little guy was alive about ten seconds ago! Oh, come on. <laughs> Squirrels are just rats with bushy tails. I cannot believe you just did that. <laughs> oh, oh my god, god. cut <laughs> that! Give it away! <sighs> Jesus, are, are you okay? Something's freaking me out already. Hey, hey, look, our, our cable car is coming. Let's grab our rides. <laughs> we just put, we just put this squirrel up. <laughs> Wanted. Oh, wait. Wanted poster. Torn up worn a wanted poster about a fugitive on the mountain. Dated 1998. Someone didn't want people to see this. Milgram Victor, sex male, height six foot two, oh, oh, just a little bit shorter than I am. Last known address is Blackwood Pines, last seen 0316. Okay, so that's okay. Wanted in connection with a first degree arson offense as well as various death threats. Anyone with information. Alright, that's pretty cool. Cable car was coming. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station. Creepy. Should I uh, climb through the window? Nope, no, no, no. I feel like Sam doesn't like me. What a crazy place to set up house, huh? No matter how rich you are. Not so rich. They only bought a mountain. <laughs> they only bought a mountain. That's not creepy. If I watch it long enough, will there be somebody walking outside? I'm not gonna watch it because that's freaky as shit. That can happen. Wish that car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of the old time of shooting at the cheap seats. How long do you think we'll be here? It's a big mountain. Thought I just saw something. Come together again, you know. Our best friends died. Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell this time, right? I kind of feel worried. No, no, it was it was a good idea. I'm glad we went out. <laughs> no, no, it was, it was a good idea. Don't worry about it. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. You know how Josh and I met? No. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started trap snapping the train bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I would sit. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next. 
thanks to John. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. Match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like a few years earlier, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off the train bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. I mean, right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Oh. Don't make me... If they make me play as a kid in, like, third grade... Oh, I was about to say, if they make me play as a kid in third grade, that'd be cool, but it'd be weird. Snapping at third graders. <laughs> this is training for all life. <laughs> oh. Jeff. Mike's new girlfriend. New. Okay. Trusting. Irreverent. Confident. Okay. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Time to meet and greet. Everybody loves a meet and greet. Okay. Oh. What the hell? Jess! Hey! Jessica! Over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Could you please? Tell this bitch is a bitch. <laughs> oh That's what a reverend means. My God, I thought we were goddess. Another ten minutes in there, and I would have chewed off my own leg. Huh. Thanks, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. <laughs> hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal. Oh, okay. Do not be a jerk. That's my goodness. Oh. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Explain. I'm with Mike now. Mike and M. Flint were together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. <laughs> in clear cut, actually, M's out. I'm in. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. We're getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? what? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, whoever. Uh -huh. <laughs> Sam. <sighs> Did you see the view? I mean. Couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Mike's ex. Oh god, intelligent, resourceful, persuasive. I don't think it would have been like as pretty as this place. Matt, Emily's new boyfriend. Motivated, ambitious, active. You know. And where's the bellboy when you need one? <laughs> Making me scared of the fucking bags, asshole. Damn, this guy looks like the bags are like 50 pounds and he's carrying them both with one hand. We're almost there. No, I mean, you're getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. You're definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> well, damn. Matt, Mike, Emily's ex, intelligent, driven, persuasive. Damn, dude, everybody's your ex is really new really ex and the old ex us, and Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Cool. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're out in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get in the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? <laughs> trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. <laughs> Bitchy. <laughs> Starting back up, right? Yeah, it would be nice. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't wanna make this weird. Cool. So we're good? Good. All good? You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. 
What the? Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the guy's car back on the trip. See you, man. See ya. See ya. Could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Oh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. I just really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Em, I really don't think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Seriously? It's cold out, and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out? I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why do you have to question everything I say? I'm sorry, Em. I'm just trying to be helpful. If you want to be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly as you can, okay? Is there, like, a break up option? Um, can I, like, break up with her, like, right away? Okay. It's fine. Whatever you want. Thank you. I'll see you up there after I go find Sam. See you in a bit. This bitch is a fucking... She's a hoe. This chick's a hoe. She's gonna go back after the other guy, Mike, or whatever. As a crush on Chris. Academic, inquisitive, or bleh, forthright. Okay. Whoa, oh. hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. How do I know? Not in the friend zone kind of way. <laughs> need to check the expiration date on that big breakup. How do I know? I'm oh! Whoa! Oh, God. <laughs> Fuck. Hey, whoa. <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare you. Well, I did mean to Holy scare you. Sort of scare you, but not like a real <laughs> scare you. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Hey, well. Man, I'm really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with those things? Uh, it, Let me check it out. Uh, uh. Um, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out. Yes. Uh oh. <sighs> Son of a bitch. What? Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably not the. Nothing, you think? <laughs> well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I uh, damn it. Matt. Uh oh. This is gonna cause issues. This is gonna cause issues. Okay, we're back to this chick. Read book, check phone. Check phone. You did not just do that. Put your hand where I can see it. We've got you, Sam. What the hell am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a skillful young rebel girl, have but to surrender to this strapping military guy come to take me into custody? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs>
comes to you investing can't hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. calling it my favor then you're a worthy opponent miss jessica the snowball queen okay that sounds vaguely dirty my lady oh wow save some for later buddy endless reserves <laughs> we should get up to the lodge yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might breathe to death somewhere between those quotes. Damn. That chick's horny. <laughs> Who's in the... Who's in the cable car? Oh. Hello again. And how are we? Do I have to go back to this guy every time I make a decision? We came from good club in our last session. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Great. Men. Men worry me. Women worry me. My guy or a girl, who am I playing as? <laughs> Women worry me. Crowd scare me, flames scare me. Crowd. Holy shit, yeah, drowning. I don't know which one scares me most, really, because I like snakes. Yeah, fuck it, I'll put snakes. I like snakes, but rats aren't scary at all, so. Oh, shit. Knives, no, not, knives aren't really, guns are more freaky than knives. Really. Sna snakes, I say cockroaches. We'll go, f we'll do, uh, cockroaches. I don't really like cockroaches, but I'll do it fuck. Am I, like, done here? Hello? Oh, hi. Well, I, I don't know, these guys aren't really, don't really scare me, but we'll go ghost mother. What the fuck? Crows or gore? I like gore, so we'll see. Oh, oh. you had to talk again. So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. I'm very concentrated. Don't can <laughs> smack the table. Try to okay. speed up. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightened you will find this experience. Spiders are creepy. Let 
videos weren't that bad. Am I just like okay? <laughs> zombies. I love zombies. I always lose everything, but you know. Yeah, dogs or crows. Crows. Can handle a dog. Storms, crows. Crows. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so innocently. This guy's a creepy guy. Again, we're out of time, but I promise. Yeah, can I go buy my game, please? Numbers. 